what I've been setting up hey Kenny Ox. how are you doing doing great that, that's good to hear that's good to hear so the PC for the whole railway yard thingy is set up it works and it's beautiful so it's here this is our uh, little setup for uh, checking. So the, the root slaves are already on uh, startup mode, so they automatically run. The other things I have still in manual mode. So um, root right. Let me wait. Let me change root right destination. So in this file, we've been here before. Uh, we, if I go down all the way, write down the roots. With over here the uh, name of the root. And then what it should do. So in this case it's a renaming of the terrain itself. This is setting the speed. Uh, destination. Set the speed back up. Destination, destination, etc. So. Uh, oh, that was actually your thing. I see. Yeah, it was next to uh, the uh, guardian thing of Tony. So that's why I found it. So. I've already written them down, so I don't need to do that again. We also have on here a, a station IDs list. So what we do in here is we basically assign a station name to an ID. And what we can now do is if we do root mainframe. So this one is now running. And this one isn't running yet, because the only thing I want to show you is what I've written down. Quickly go through it. Um, most important thing is this. A parallel wait for any. It basically runs the root loop and wait for a receive. So um, I have this set up so that if the redstone power on the back of, a, uh, um, of one of these senders basically goes on, it will re quest to do a certain uh, route. So it will send that one, for example, to there or whatever. Um, if it's already, if, if this one is already running a loop, then it cannot receive a next, actually a task. So this has to resend a task every three seconds. I've, I've set it to right now. Um, so it will get eventually actually picked up. But right now it has no tasks. So if we do route, if we do this, we see nothing happening right now. As soon as I repower the redstone signal, we see it will move actually the train. It will start up. This has sent uh, the request to the main PC. It has started. It's now running all of the actions. So you see it arriving at the station. It's running a new action. This is the PC ID uh, or no, the action list ID and then the PC ID. It's running an action again. And as soon as it, so it actually moved it from here to there, back to there, back to there. So as soon as it's done, it is done. It will basically run nothing anymore right now. Until I now request it another time, it will restart. So now it will instantly say this. So if it's now running this, if it's now running actually uh, this right now, and I ask it, ask it again, it cannot receive right now a new uh, thing to do, actually, uh, a task. So every three seconds you see this, that's basically when it's sending a signal to the main PC. Thank you, actually, Kenyox, for uh, saying that. Uh, yes, it's indeed that one. So, um, so now it is uh, done. So it has done, actually, the last thing in its uh, thing. So that's sending the terrain from right over there to there. And then as, as you <laughs> could see, actually, um, it starts the next task as soon as it's done with the last one. So that's basically how it works. This allows us to basically send... Um, we will have at each platform one of these slaves. We'll have at the yard lead one of those slaves. We will have one of these uh, PCs that will ask for a new engine um, at each lane. So we can then have random engines come up to random wagons and send them off on their route. 
The roots for now will still be the same since um, the computer craft uh, scheme. No, how do you mean it? How, how do you say it? Uh, schedule is bugged. So otherwise, I could make automatic schedules to go to Yorick and then randomize that to actually go uh, actually to PIM, etc. Um, so the roots are fixed for actually where they are on the things, um, on the lanes in the station itself, but the engines will be randomized and reused. Um, so yeah, that's that. Men can solve the world with all his time, but spend it on MC. Yes, definitely. No, I, I had to write all of this code. I had to write all of these things with, uh, because one single function in create is bugged. And that's the schedule function if you send it by actually a, a thing, actually a, a monitor like this. Because apparently, it, because it randomizes the schedule, etc. I've, I've actually said it before, but it randomizes the schedule. So I've basically written my own schedule processing PC because creates schedule processing thing doesn't work correctly yes so I've basically added a modded feature within the mod that already exists but sure really complicated makes no sense we'll get my yard fixed 